Hey guys, guys, we have our last installment of the week for uh, Legends of the Hidden Temple, The Lost Temple Guards. Now, you remember me saying earlier that I am going to be on the bed. Why, you ask? Well, finally it's time to reveal it. We are doing the other legend, which I actually own on DVD. It is the jewel-encrusted egg of Catherine the Great. As mentioned, uh, I believe, uh, here. Here, I think, yeah. Jewel encrusted egg of Catherine the Great. Good thing they had a season three legend, otherwise I wouldn't have been interested. I don't know why, but I mean, I just think season three is like my favorite all-time year, basically. Anyway, second time to the big screen, we have one lost guard. Hard to track down. Here we go. Oh, we are ready to get in position. Olmec needs to lower his... Of course, Olmec needs to lower his gate, clearly. It's been three minutes on the clock. And they're doing that now. Yup. Alrighty. Let's go. Into the temple. Which way is he going to go? Oh, he's going up into the crypt. Why? Because why not? Oh, that's why not. Temple guard. Yikes. Not a good way to start if you had less than two pendants. All right, now the pit of the pendulum. It used to knock over the column. Everybody knew that. Ah, uh, he wanted to go up, but that's torture. Oh, and another or one bites him completely. Now Kristen's going up, up following Chris's path. There's nothing in the ledges, by the way, if you don't already know. This girl is serious, I mean, really. And why is she serious? Because she also competed in uh, Guts beforehand. And for the people that are really nostalgic. Now the heartbeat, he has to come in, and yep, it's on the left one. Theory lives in this one. Even though in some cases it has been broken. Anyway, on to the Jester's Court. Far we go. Got to line your body up with the, all the actuators at the same time. The middle one on works majority of the time, usually. On to the Dark Forest. Beware of a Temple Spirit, if any. There's none. Yep, she's heading up to the Shrine. By the way, she skipped the Lost Guard. Alright, hate to spoil it, but there's nothing in the shrine. But she has to get that monkey together. Got the base. Yeah, now the middle. Well, yeah, she's getting all of them because, I mean, it's quicker. And why not, honestly? Middle, she has to get that middle on. Come on. Alright, let's get that head on! Alright, now she gotta get the jewel encrusted egg. Sad that my favorite room is not being utilized. Heist. And of course she's taking the upper path because, well, it's quicker. Obviously. Any team should know that. In case the show revamps. Oh, yeah. Field goal is good. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. It looked like a half field goal. Well, unfortunately. And, yeah, you want to know where that lost guard is, of course. Well, let me reveal it. Uh, let's see, the let's see, the final guard was actually, now I heard people saying online that it's the quicksand bug. That's actually wrong, and I can actually prove it. How, you ask? Well, let's look in the credits. Well, let's look in the credits. Let's, give me a minute, guys. I gotta get the right point up. Yeah. Yeah, if we look in the credit scene here. here ignore the lettering, people. Well, on the very left, right here 
you can tell that the slide definitely doesn't have anything, unfortunately. And it's not supposed to be that much of a gap, have honestly. And, uh, yeah. And, yeah, technically there's... Yeah, there's because there's a really big gap where... Because if it wasn't much of a gap, then it would be more filled, and the temple guard would have been in it. So, actually, the final guard was in the room of the secret password. Or for many of you that didn't know it, really. But yeah, the room of the secret password was actually the last guard. All right, I, there's your proof. There's your proof for the people who said for the person who said the quicksand bog. Og, it clearly is wrong. Hung. And this time we can actually prove it. Anyway, I've said enough. Eric Zubik signing off. See you next week. Oh, yeah.